welcome students in this video we are going to study another alkaloid that is reserpine reserpine occurs in the plant ravalpia serpentina that is sarpagandha its class is indol alkaloid its molecular formula is c33h40n2o9 Reserpine occurs in Ravalpia serpentina and R. vomitoria plant species. Isolation: It is isolated from roots of Ravalpia serpentina, that is Serpagandha. First isolated in 1952 by Sutter et al. Properties: It is a weak base. Its melting point is 264 degrees Celsius. it is optically active compound and it is leu rotatory uses roots of this flowering plant has been used in centuries by the natives of himalayan region in india to cure snake bites it's it is mainly used to control hypertension headache epilepsy fever dizziness etc now we see constitution of reserpine in constitution the first step is determination of its molecular formula then nature of oxygen atoms reserpine contains two methoxy group sorry five methoxy groups 1 2 3 4 and five methoxy groups then nature of nitrogen atom first is present of indole nucleus and then presence of tertiary nitrogen atom then hydrolysis studies in that first presence of two ester groups then structure of reserpic acid and finally the structure is confirmed by synthesis that is synthesis of reserpine these are the steps for structure elicitation of reserpine the first step is determination of molecular formula by qualitative and quantitative analysis and by molecular weight determination the molecular formula of reserpine is c33h40n2o9 for this molecular formula the site of unsaturation that is double bond equivalent is equal to 15 the nature of nitro oxygen atoms in reserpine there are five methoxy groups and that methoxy groups are detected and estimated by gissels method reserpine when heated with hydroiodic acid at 126 degrees celsius it gives five molecules of methyl iodide which indicates presence of five methoxy groups in reserpine this is the general reaction for estimation of methoxy group compound containing methoxy group when heated with hydroiodic acid it gives methyl iodide and one mole of och3 group corresponds to one mole of methyl iodide and reserpine it forms five methyl iodide which indicates there are five methoxy groups in reserpine this is the reaction for reserpine reserpine requires five molecules of hydroiodic acid and it gives five molecules of methyl iodide then next is nature of nitrogen atoms the first presence of indol nucleus as reserpine it is a weak base that indicates that both nitrogen atoms should be present in the ring these are the two nitrogen atoms and both nitrogen atoms are present in the ring therefore reserpine is a weak base reserpine does not have hydroxy group but it forms monoacetal derivative that indicates that there is presence of secondary nitrogen atom that is presence of that nh group this is the acetylation reaction for secondary amine and it gives monoacetal derivative ir study shows that there is presence of indol nucleus in reserpine this is the indol nucleus 
which is present in resin. Then next, presence of tertiary nitrogen atom. Reserpine forms methyl iodide with methyl iodide, which indicates that second nitrogen atom must be tertiary in nature. And it also proved by as it requires one mole of methyl iodide to form quaternary salt. That is, tertiary amine requires one mole of methyl iodide to form a quaternary salt. That is, another nitrogen atom in reserpine, it is in tertiary in nature. Then, the next is hydrolysis studies. In that, first we prove presence of two ester groups. These are the two ester groups. This is the one ester group and this is the another ester group. And we have to prove these two ester groups. These are proved like this. Upon alkaline hydrolysis, reserpine gives mixture of methyl alcohol, 3,4,5 trimethoxybenzoic acid and reserpic acid. Ester upon hydrolysis gives acid and alcohol and reserpine upon hydrolysis gives methyl alcohol, 3,4,5 trimethoxybenzoic acid and reserpic acid. And formation of that products indicate that reserpine contains two ester groups. These are the two acids and there is one alcohol and that hydrolysis studies indicate that Reserpine does not contain COOH group. The structure of reserpine does not contain COOH or OH groups, but there are two COOH groups, one in 3,4,5 trimethoxybenzoic acid and another in reserpic acid. And among two hydroxy groups, one is in methyl alcohol and another is in reserpic acid. That reaction indicates that reserpine or reserpic acid contains two ester groups. Each reserpine contains two ester groups. That is, it is a diester. Reserpine is a diester. The ester linkage in reserpine is further confirmed by reduction reaction with lithium aluminum hydride. Reserpine upon reduction gives 3,4,5 trimethoxy benzyl alcohol plus a racer peak alcohol. This also indicates presence of ester linkage in racer pine. Now we see structure of racer peak acid. The molecular formula of racer peak acid is C22H28N2O4. Racer peak acid contains one COOH group which is estimated by silver salt method. One mole of acid when treated with ammonical silver nitrate, it gives silver salt and which gives one mole of silver. Then presence of one OH group. This is the structure of reserpic acid and it contains one COOH group and one alcoholic OH group. Reserpic acid contains one alcoholic OH group and it is confirmed by as reserpic acid upon oxidation gives ketone because secondary alcohol upon oxidation gives ketone with same number of carbon atoms. Then next, presence of two methoxy groups in reserpic acid and it is estimated by Giesel's method. This is the general reaction for Giesel's method. Then nature of two nitrogen atoms. Reserpic acid contain two nitrogen atoms. Reserpic acid contains two nitrogen atoms and that are present in heterocyclic ring. And one is in the form of secondary amino group and other is in tertiary form. Therefore, reserpic acid can be shown as C19H20N2 and that reserpic acid contains two methoxy group, one alcoholic OH group and one SIBO OH group. Now we have to prove the another part of the reserpic acid. Then next is the reduction of reserpic acid. 
upon reduction reciprocic acid gives reciprocic alcohol and that reciprocic alcohol contains one methoxy group one oh group and one ch2oh group therefore reciprocic alcohol can be shown as that is the whole structure of reciprocic acid and alcohol contains two methoxy group one oh group and one ch2oh then oxidation of reciprocic acid reciprocic acid upon oxidation with kno4 gives four methoxy n oxyl anthranilic acid that is the reaction reciprocic acid upon oxidation with kno4 gives four methoxy n oxyl anthranilic acid and formation of that product indicates that there is presence of one indol nucleus in reciprocic acid this is the indol nucleus and it also shows that methoxy group is present at meta position to the secondary amino group then reciprocic acid upon fusion with koh gives five hydroxy isothalic acid this is five hydroxy isothalic acid the reciprocic acid upon heating with acetic anhydride gives gamma lactone this is the gamma lactone and formation of that product indicate that oh and coh group in reciprocic acid must be present in meta position that is 1 to 3 position to each other reciprocic acid on the other hand upon esterification with methanol gives methyl reciprocate which upon dehydrogenation with selenium gives two known products that is eubrine and seven hydroxy eubrine reciprocic acid esterification with methyl alcohol gives methyl reciprocate which upon degradation gives the two products eubrine and seven hydroxy eubrine whose structures were known these are the known compounds and that eubrine contains indol ring and pyridine ring indol ring and pyridine ring as eubrine is formed from reciprocic acid that is it indicates that reciprocic acid may possess following skeleton this is the skeleton for reciprocic acid then we see what is the position of coh oh and methoxy group in reciprocic acid these are the numbering of carbon atoms for that skeleton 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 32 33 34 35 36 37 38 39 40 41 42 43 44 45 46 47 48 49 50 51 52 53 54 55 56 57 58 59 60 61 62 63 64 65 66 67 68 69 70 71 72 73 74 75 76 77 78 79 80 81 82 83 84 85 86 87 88 89 90 now we see one by one on fusion with koh reciprocic acid gives five hydroxy isothalic acid which indicates that coh and oh group must be at meta position that is at 1 to 3 position to each other reciprocic acid when dehydrogenated then it gives 11 hydroxy 16 methyl eubrine this product is possible only when coh group is present at c16 that is coh group must be present at carbon atom number 16 and as coh group is present at c16 oh group must be present at c18 that is at 1 to 3 position the another methoxy group is assigned at c17 which is proved by biogenetic consideration the methoxy group is present at c17 and the structure of reciprocic acid is like this this is the structure of reciprocic acid this is the main skeleton which contains that indol nucleus this is a saturated pyridine ring and presence of one coh group two methoxy group and one oh group and oh and coh are at 1 to 3 position now we see the structure of reciprocal reciprocal it is a diester of reciprocic acid therefore reciprocic acid plus methanol plus 3 4 5 trimethoxybenzoic acid and 
when they combine together we get the structure of racerpine and this is the structure of racerpine which contains five methoxy group two ester groups one indole nucleus out of two nitrogen atoms one is secondary nitrogen and one nitrogen is tertiary nitrogen and this is the structure of racerpine and that structure of racerpine is then confirmed by synthesis and these are the steps for synthesis of racerpine starting product is starting compound is para benzophenone plus transvinyl acrylic acid and the synthesis are step by step like this These are the steps. This is the product number one. Then six methoxy triptamine plus product number one. The steps are like this. at C3 and we get the product racerpine and this is the synthesis of racerpine which is given by R.B. Woodward ETA in 1956. Thanks for watching this video.